Well, I hope everyone's doing well. You know, sometimes the best laid plans happen. Sometimes they don't. Sometimes coronaviruses kick into the world and change everything for everybody. We have to adjust and do what we can, right? And I had all these big plans to put out a beginner course. But something tells me that to hold off on that. Um, and my inner gut, I got to follow that, right? Your heart, your gut, whatever you want to call it. And if anyone asks me what I do, I say, just to keep it simple, I say, even though many things in life, I, I say I'm a jazz violinist. Even I play other instruments, and I'm a teacher, and I'm a husband, and a father, and a bunch of things in my life. I say I'm a jazz violinist. So the angels are telling me, the spirits are telling me, like, duh, this is what you're saying you are. Why don't you teach that first? You can always get to a beginner course later. Um, and I'll be, get to a beginner's course soon enough, I'm sure. So, I thought about it for a little bit. And well, I don't know if there's as big of a market for all these business things, you know, for jazz. But this is what I am. This is what I do. And I think I can benefit people. And it's all about us benefiting each other right now, right? So, the world is changing. I want to change too. And uh, I have a lot to give. And I might as well share it. So... I'm making an announcement right now that I'm going to do a 100 video series. I'm committing to doing 100 of uh, jazz lessons for free. So, um, that, that's what the spirits tell me to do. <laughs> 100. Okay, so I think it's going to be super in-depth. No, I'm going to try and keep them all short. And I'm going to try and uh, give you stuff... Um, including why the heck should you even think about learning jazz if you don't do jazz now why should you think about it i'll get into all this stuff what do you do you, maybe you hate jazz i i hate some parts of jazz too i hate what jazz becomes sometimes and i'll talk about that i'll talk about all these tricks and tips you can do on your fiddle and your violin even if you don't want to play jazz how learning jazz can help you be able to be free and creative in all styles and it'll improve your ear and you'll be able to hear anything and play anything and where you can get into trouble because you think you know too much too and how to dumb it down and get simple again and get be human. So I've been through all these avenues in life, and many more. Uh, I, have, I can share them with you. And uh, so that's my big announcement. I'm going to do a 100 video lesson series for free. You'll get them right here on YouTube or maybe a couple other places, Facebook or a few other places. I'll repopulate them to repost them. But um, that's it. That's what the spirits are telling me to do. So that's what I got to do, right? And you can give me comments or feedback. Um, let's get started with these 100. I'm going to get to number one tonight. I hope I will. <laughs> Amen. Let's do this. Okay, okay.